Good morning and welcome to Semicon West 2008. My name is Tom Perling and I work for Helical Products Company out of Santa Maria, California, the original beam style manufacturer. What we're showing today is the helical flexure which started out as a beam style coupling and has grown into much, much more which is also we call a machined spring. What we've got here is a, is a dynamic trade show display that uh, shows some of the capabilities of the helical flexure. We've started off down in this section here with a machine spring which is a compression spring that is being compressed by this cam and launching the ball up and one, another flexure is being used here as a torsional spring damping the ball as it comes down the ramp and it's a display that, that like I said, you shows some of the capabilities of the flexure. Um, comes down through an extreme 90 degree U-joint here and then passes through and here we've shown how you can take a right and a left hand flexure and use it as a compression where the two arms will remain parallel because the center section compensates for the wind up. And then it f flows through here and you can see here we have a one piece U-joint to be able to compensate for parallel misalignment and then come through another 90 degree U-joint. And as you can see a standard coupling can be used two of them to be able to uh, compensate for skewed misalignment as well. Um, the display actually was a original senior project for Cal Poly San Luis students and we took their ideas and refined it and put it into a trade show display that can be portable and brought in and moved around to different trade shows. As I mentioned before, um, other than beam style couplings, Helical also manufactures what we call a machine spring. Some of the advantages of machine springs uh, when you're using them as a compression spring is we can do what you call a multiple start spring. And what I mean by a multiple start spring is if you'll notice with this particular spring here it is similar to your standard wire wound spring which has a single start which is one continuous coil. The spring to the right is what we would call a double start spring. And a double start spring has another coil starting at 180 degrees opposite of the original coil. So you have what can also be commonly known as a double helix. The advantage of that is that what you can do is by having a multiple start you can actually resolve the moment um, that happens with a standard single start spring and we've got this demonstrator here to show what happens um, and how the actual multiple start can cancel out the moment and resolve it. Okay, so what we've done is we've taken the single start spring and we've put it in to this and on top of the spring is a ball bearing to be able to allow the spring to tip to one side or the other if there is indeed a moment. And as we compress this, you'll see that the spring shoots off to one side because there's a moment. With a double start spring, in theory, if you have an equal and opposite force, they should cancel each other. And so as we go to compress the double start, you can notice it doesn't tip to one side. When we do add forces to the side, it will tip over just like the single start spring. But the single start spring starts and tips Okay, as we discussed before, machine springs can be used as compression springs, but they can also be used as torsional springs. And what this apparatus shows is some of the, again, advantages of machine springs. Here we've got a wire wound spring, and one of the challenges that you have with wire wound is in a torsional spring is trying to grab onto it and twist it. So what happens is as a torsional spring is twisted, you get that tipping and what you really want is a twisting so you'll usually put a mandrel down the center to support the spring and what happens then is you end up getting binding on the spring and friction well what we can do is because we can machine the spring we could machine a slot in the end of it we could also machine a hex bore in the end of it or we can do pins. We can do any type of 
attachment um, because again we're machining material and what that does is now when you twist the spring you actually produce a pure moment in the spring Okay, thanks again for stopping by our booth here at Semicon West 2008. Um, again, Helico Products were the original beam style manufacturer uh, that has grown into much, much more, as we mentioned, the machine springs. Um, we've been in semiconductor industry for several years, but also medical, aerospace, and satellite, all different types of industries we get into. Um, as we discussed, machine springs is an innovative concept um, that utilizes the helical flexure along with our beam style couplings. So once again, thanks for stopping by Semicon 2008. For more information, please log on to our website at www.heli-cal.com.